I was in that point in my life where I was like, if it happens, it happens. And so he pursued me, and that's when I knew that it was someone that actually wanted to be with me. And so I got back from Costa Rica, and he's like, you ready for that date? And I'm like, sure, let's do it. Our first date, when we met at On the Border, like the first time I saw her, I was nervous because of her beauty. I had like the full intention of walking in, meeting this guy and being like, no thanks. But I walked in and I was like, dang it. Our first date, we kicked it off pretty well. I actually spilled a, some, a drink on her and she took that extremely well, which was surprising for the first date, but it's just, everything clicked. It just, it, everything felt right. I just knew that he was the one for me. And I think it took him a little bit longer, but I'm kind of that person that's always definitively like, yes. And so when I saw Ethan, it was just, I knew. It was a mock, I guess, photo shoot with a friend of ours. She handed me a chalkboard and she said, write what you love most about Ethan. She's like, okay, turn around on three. I turn around, I'm like, no way. And then I got down on a knee and then asked. He's like, will you marry me? I'm like, well, yeah, duh. <laughs> Ethan's the best, he takes care of his family, he takes care of me, and I really love that about him. Just how caring, just sweet. Definitely puts everybody else before her. Someone you would always want by your skin. I, Ethan, take the ring to be my wedded wife. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better or for worse. For richer or poor. To love or to cherish. Till death do his part. It's with great joy that I pronounce you husband and wife. Find it written in the sky. 